Thank you, my master. No problem. <laughs> All right, let's go check this out. Oh yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. So beautiful. Oh, it's so high. Ah. All right, mate. Come on out here. Let's go. <laughs> That's it. I mean, all the way up. Yes. You can do it. Yeah, all the way up. Perfect. A little bit more, and there you go. All right. Now you see the white camera right here? Yeah. Walk till you get there, and then stop. Okay. Okay. You're my guard. All right. We'll do. We'll do. Warren's right behind you. Katie. <laughs> Meal's coming out. No, yeah. Just keep walking. Keep walking. Please, Zach. Oh, Buster. There you go. Nice. That's perfect. You made it out the door. That's like half the battle right there. <laughs> well, everybody, let me walk you to the edge walk. How you feeling? This is what 356 meters looks like. 1,168 feet or 116 building stories. The platform we're on, same width as an average city sidewalk. And we're going to follow it all the way around the tower for 150 meters or nearly 500 feet. Now below us is actually the roof of the 360 restaurant, so you may smell yumminess coming out of there. And above us another 31 stories, sky pod and one person looking down. Oh, two people looking down at us right now. You guys get to check that out later with your tickets if you want. But right now, without getting too close, take a little sneak peek over the edge. Check out how high up you are. You can see it a little bit, yeah, you're right. Just a little bit. It's kind of hazy, but you can see it out there. Is that a harbor? Yeah. It's on the other side of the island. I don't know where we're looking at. Niagara Falls. Yeah, so there's like buildings coming. So we haven't been out here for very long, but you know what? We should start some activities now, right? <laughs> Everybody take a little step back so I can see Zach back there. The first thing I'm going to show you how to do is called Toes Over Toronto. And it's kind of obvious. But what you're going to do when it's your turn is you're simply going to wander towards the edge. Then you're going to put some toes over Toronto. And if you're feeling okay about that, feel free to let go of your best friend here and give Toronto a big fat wave. Hello, Toronto! I don't think anybody can hear you, so you can yell as loud as you want. Zach, start us off on this one, buddy. Come on, give us some toes over Toronto. What? <laughs> Come on, Zach. Give us some toes over Toronto. Zach, you can do it. Okay. Little toe, little toe. Yeah, there it is. He's got a toe. He's made it official. Give it up for Zach, everybody. Lead us off there. Yeah. All right, take a little step back. Lee, why don't you give this a try? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. That's it. Nice. There you go. Good job. Looking all the way down when she does that, too. All right, Mayo, come on out here. <laughs> oh, yeah. There it is. Nice! There <laughs> go! Katie! <laughs> That's it, Katie. Perfect! Yeah! <laughs> Warren, your turn! <laughs> Perfect! Nice! Looking straight down. Way to go! Alright, come on out here. I know you want to see it. <laughs> Yeah, just little tiny steps. A little shuffle, little shuffle. Almost there. Yeah. You can do it. There. There you got it. Nicely done. Nicely done. <laughs> now, I don't know how you felt. If you, you felt nervous about that, that's okay because most people who do edge walks said toes over is the scariest activity. I think it's because you don't feel anything holding on to you yet, right? Well, you're definitely going to feel the harness when we do one of these, all right? Now, so before we get started on this one, I want everybody to turn and face me this way and continue to turn until you're facing the tower here. Excellent. I'm going to come down here. You guys take one step back there so I can see Mayor. Now, <laughs> so what you're going to do when it's your turn is you're simply going to sit down in your harness until it takes all of your weight and your feet are flat in front of you, kind of like sitting in a chair. Don't try to hold yourself up or tuck your feet under. It gets really awkward, okay? Just let the harness do all the work for you. Then you're gonna walk backwards until you get the heels over the edge. Dig them into the side of the platform. Push yourself back. Straighten those legs, shoulders back, and enjoy a really nice lean off the top, all right? Now, two tips to this. 
feet apart gives you better balance, more stability. Secondly, legs straight. Not only are you using a lot less thigh muscles when you're doing this, but if you're nervous, it won't show if your legs are straight, all right? <laughs> then we're gonna go that way. So Zach, start us off here, buddy. No, 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 turn it. <laughs> Sit on down in your harness. Okay, Just keep staying, keep staying. I think I'm gonna, gonna, I think I'm gonna, gonna let, You're gonna let, let later? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna come back to you, okay? okay. You let me know, okay? okay. All right. Oh, Lee? okay, all right. Lee? First thing, just sit down, all the way. Good. All right. Now, slowly walk backwards until you get the heels over. And don't touch the metal part, just touch the rope. You got it. Good. Good. There you go. Perfect. Now, push yourself backwards until the legs are straight. Push your shoulders back. That is a really nice lean back. How do you feel? Awesome. Then stay there. Okay. Stay there. Awesome. All right. Yeah, Emil, go ahead. Sit all the way down. Feet in front. Yeah. Feet in front of you. Like you in a chair. Good. Now walk it back, buddy. Steady. There you go. Feet apart. Good. Stretch out nice and long. Straight low, straight low legs. There you go. That's what I want to see. All right, Katie. Let's give this a try, okay? Sit all the way down. Good. Good, good, good. Don't walk up back. I like the sound effects you're adding, that's good. <laughs> nice. Perfect. Hey, you got it. Alright, push yourself back. Straighten the legs as you push. There you go, Katie. Nice job. There you go. Alright, Warren, your turn. Sit on down. All the way back. Get the heels over the edge. Slowly steady. Awesome. Straighten those legs, buddy. Push your shoulders back even farther. Nice, there you go. All right, Vader, take one step that way. All right, take one step this way. Then. All right, now you can sit. Feel a little harness grip. Perfect, there you go, that's perfect. Now, walk backwards, yeah. Sit. Keep walking. Sit around there, keep it there. Sit. One more? No, no, about three more. Tiny step with that foot, one tiny step with that one. There, that's it. Uh, now, keep sitting down and just push yourself backwards. Push that way. Push, 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 push. Straight legs. Yeah. Come on, hands. Mater, hands. Good, good, good. Relax yourself. Let the harness do the work, all right? Oh, no, stay there, go Stay there, yes, yeah, stay there. I'm coming down here to Zach here. Zach, you want to get a try, buddy? I told myself I was going to do it. Yeah. And now that we got up here, I don't think I can. You sure? Let's just. I'll tell you no, what. I can't. Can. Let's, do it. Let's just do the sit down part. Like okay. Sitting on the edge. Okay. okay. Can I do it on the inside? Do you Face this way. No, we're gonna do it. We're gonna try this way. I'm just gonna show you. Okay. I'm not gonna push you. I'm not gonna. You're not gonna swing out. Just sit down. I'm gonna steady your rope. All the way. Just sit down. You don't have to go anywhere. All the way down. Ooh. This is as far down as I. No, no, you can. You can go. Sit down. Stop your weight. And then put your feet in front of you. Nope, nope, nope. You sure? Yep. Oh, wait. It's not happening. When we get around the other side, we'll try it another way, okay? <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Keep this in mind. We're going to try this with photos later on. Okay. But you guys got the hang of it. Grab your ropes. Walk yourselves back in the middle here. And give yourselves a big round of applause. Nicely done. Nicely done. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, your side of the tower means a new activity. You guys have done the toes over, a little lean back. We're gonna try a little Titanic pose, a little lean forward up the tower, all right? All right, everybody take a little step back. I wanna make sure Mater can see me back there. Now, on this one, we're not gonna put the toes over, okay? Instead, I want your toes around the second line from the edge. Feet apart, as always, you got some good balance. Take your rope, push it out in front of you so all the metal stuff here is nice and straight. Don't hold it close to your chest to make it all loosey-goosey, all right? Push it out and you leave it there. And then you bring your body nice and straight all the way into the rope to get it in your shoulder. And just like the lean back, it holds you up and you have this awesome view of Toronto. Now, if you're feeling confident and you want that little bit of extra on this one, watch my toes, you can actually go extra right on the tippy toes, all right? So we're going to change it up a little bit here. I'm actually going to start down at the other end here. Mater, give us a little lean forward demonstration here. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Not a chance. All right, go. Keep leaning forward, Mater. Lean forward so you feel the rope in your shoulder. 
There you go. Now you see the elevator. <laughs> All right, take a little step back. We're gonna do this one at a time. All right, Warren. One more step closer, Warren. There you go. Perfect. Lean all the way in there. Trust the rope. Trust, Trust the rope. Keep leaning, keep leaning forward. Go, go, go. Here. See the rope like this? Put, leave it there. You had it. Lean into it. Keep your hips straight. And let go. I, wanna, I don't want to see this. I want to see this. Superman. Do your Superman. Yeah, there it is. Nicely done. All right, Katie. <laughs> Go, Katie! <laughs> Go, Katie! <laughs> That's good. All right. Push the rope straight out. Yep, and then lean forward. <laughs> there. there you go. Yeah, you did it. Nicely done. All right, Amelia, come on out here. <laughs> come on. Amelia, yeah, push the rope out, Emil. And take one step back. Right to this line. Follow me here. Yeah. One more step. There you go. Push the rope straight out and then lean into it. There he oh. goes. All right. All right. Lee. All right. Yeah. Go, right. <laughs> Lee. Okay. Oh, she's got it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh. Nice. Oh. Looking straight down when she does that, too. That's awesome. You got it. All right. Zach, you want to give this a try? I will. All right. Perfect. Push the rope straight out, my friend. There you go. That's what I want to see, buddy. Yeah, yeah. All right. There it is. Nice lady. I don't hate this one. It is weird, isn't it? Nice. So about a half an hour ago, we came out of the summit room onto the edge walk. Do you remember how you felt? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now you've gone around the tower, did a little exercise, a few activities, had your photos taken, and you are Guinness World Record holders because you've just done the highest outdoor hands-free walk in a building in the entire planet. Give yourselves a little round of applause there. Nicely done. All right. Now we do have to go back in. As we do so, just hold on to your rope. We're gonna head over here. The rail goes down. Just keep a hold of that rope and don't forget to wave at all your fans as you go on by here. And as you pass by me, I need a little socially distant high five. Ready? I'll add the sound effects. There we go. Anyway, go on in here. One. High five. You're welcome. Awesome. Lee, give it up. Zach. Awesome. Hello, my name's Steven. I'm also known as Esteban here. Thanks for coming to Toronto and enjoying the edge walk.